Ladies and gentlemen, it is very, very rare that I upload this late at night, but we have something that needs to be talked about, and that is Warzone Pacific, specifically the story behind Warzone Pacific, because in the Call of Duty Vanguard live stream today, they put out a trailer for it, the first cutscene that we have for the new Warzone Pacific, and it gives us the backstory on what we need to know about the map. On top of that, it actually answers some questions about the previous cutscene that we saw for Season 6. We'll dive into that as well. And one thing I can tell you before we dive in is that later today, at I believe 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, I have Call of Duty Vanguard gameplay for you. It's early gameplay I was able to get from Activision. So make sure you stay tuned to the channel today. We have a lot of stuff coming over the next couple of days. So stay tuned. I've got a lot for you there. But without further ado, I'm going to shut up and let's have a look, really the first look at some Warzone Pacific stuff. Someone started the party without us. Let's move. We've got company. Keep your eyes peeled. You see that shit? Fucking Nazis. Hope they're all still burning in hell. Psst. Turn around! Show us those hands! Don't do anything stupid. I heard you a mile off. No offense. If I'd meant you any harm, you'd already be dead. How about we start with who the fuck are you, and what the fuck are you doing here? Relax, gents. We're on the same side. I'm Captain Butcher of the SOE. Well, retired Captain Butcher these days. I was in charge of the SOE during the war. Ever heard of Vanguard? I created Vanguard. And all the others, too. It was a simpler time then. But the work is never done. Our victory wasn't earned till we snuffed out every last spark. After Berlin, we hunted down the rats that scurried into hiding all over the world. And it started in the Pacific. So really, as far as this cutscene goes, there is two parts to the story. One of the parts revolves around Black Ops Cold War, and one of the parts revolves around Call of Duty Vanguard and Warzone Pacific. As far as the Black Ops Cold War part of this, this cutscene takes place after the end of the Season 6 cutscene that we saw a couple of days ago. In that cutscene, at the very end, Adler is holding a pistol to the back of Stitch's head. It fades to black, we hear a gunshot, and we didn't really know what happens. Did a sniper take out Adler? Did Adler shoot Stitch? This actually answers the question because five days later, we see this cutscene with Adler very much so alive, which means basically summarizes the end of season six as, well, yes, Stitch is dead. This brings us to the second part of the trailer, and first of all, that revolves around where they are, which is a German bunker in Verdansk, and at this time, they find a bunch of Nazi paraphernalia, and then they are introduced to the new character. No offense. If I'd meant you any harm, you'd already be dead. How about we start with who the fuck are you, and what the fuck are you doing here? Relax, gents. We're on the same side. I'm Captain Butcher of the SOE. Well, retired Captain Butcher these days. I was in charge of the SOE during the war. Ever heard of Vanguard? I created Vanguard, and all the others too. It was a simpler time then, 
So Captain Butcher, this is obviously going to be a character within Call of Duty Vanguard, and as far as he goes, based off of the explanation he gives, he is the one that founded Task Force Vanguard and these other specialty divisions during World War II. Clearly, this is something the Black Ops Cold War characters have heard about or know about, because as soon as he explains this, they put down their weapons and kind of go at ease. With this character being introduced, it ties together Call of Duty Vanguard with the Black Ops Cold Cold War story, and that is where we get our next tidbit of information that is a little bit confusing and raises some questions. But the work is never done. Our victory wasn't earned till we snuffed out every last spark. After Berlin, we hunted down the rats that scurried into hiding all over the world. And it started in the Pacific. So essentially what's going on here is Butcher is talking to Woods, Mason, Adler, Hudson, and telling them his story about Task Force Vanguard and what happened after Berlin. The story of Task Force Vanguard is of Berlin and Project Phoenix, and we don't know about that yet, but we will once we play the campaign. But as far as what he is saying is after this, the rats scurried into hiding, and then they went to go flush them out, starting in the Pacific. And in doing so, that is the story that we are getting of Warzone Pacific and the map Caldera. Now, there's a couple of questions that this raises. One, is the story and us playing on Caldera going to take place during World War II, or is it going to be in this area in the 1980s? Personally, I think it's going to be during World War II, but at the same time, how we have all of these characters from Modern Warfare in 2020 and the 1984 Verdance characters from Black Ops Cold War could be because the entire setting of Caldera is actually through Butcher telling the story of what happened in World World War II. And that is how we have futuristic weapons. That is how we have futuristic characters because it's a retelling of the story. It's not actually happening live. Now, at the very end there, we do get a tiny snippet of some footage of Warzone Pacific and airplanes flying through the sky. It says take to the sky. So obviously those airplanes are going to be a very large part of the new map, which will be very interesting. And I'm curious as all hell to see how that all fits together and how the gameplay actually works but as of now this is only part one of the story it's in the title of the video that they uploaded so over the next coming weeks and before wars on pacific launches we're going to be getting more of these cutscenes and as we get them we'll break them down and put this story together of what caldera and what wars on pacific is actually going to be but as for now this is what we know captain butcher is telling us the story of the pacific and what happened after Berlin in World War II. As for this, I'm curious to hear what you guys have to say. If you enjoyed the video, always appreciate it if you hit that like button. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe, have notifications on. We've got Vanguard content coming today, so stay tuned. Hope you enjoyed, and until next time, peace out. We are